What's up guys, welcome back to Arpreg Electronics. I got something really cool for you today. This was inspired by my friend Gustav Wingbiren on uh, YouTube. He had a video of um, him playing um, Confidential Mission with a custom crosshair, which was enabled through Rocket Launcher, but that's too complicated for me and Rocket Launcher is outdated to me now. So I made some scripts here to enable a crosshair. So look at my mouse, it's just a regular mouse, right? I'm gonna show you the script. Well, you're not really gonna care about this, but here's the script, all right? You can use any crosshair uh, file you want. And the size, I made it a little bigger so it's easier to see. I set the size to 50. You can change this number here to whatever you want, to 60, 70, it'll get huge, okay? So oh, watch what happens, I double click, boom, I got a crosshair. Look how nice that is. Nice, easy crosshair, all right? And then double click the cursor return, and we're back to normal. Oops, forgot to compile the script, there we go. All right, so. All you have to do to add this to a game, and where this might be useful, is games that um, either A, uh, have been patched, like Big Buck Hunter HD, or B, just, um, you know, you just wanted a cursor instead of a mouse cursor. You, if you wanted a crosshair instead of a cursor, I'm sorry. So a good example of this would be Fruit Ninja, okay, which is normally not a light gun game, but I'll show you what I did here. You go to Edit Metadata, Additional Apps, all right? Uh, I'll, I'll delete everything just so I can show you step by step. You go to add application, all right, and the name, I'm gonna put crosshair. In the application path, I'm gonna pick the green icon, all right, not the script, because if you pick the script, you're gonna have um, some issues uh, with big box focus. I'm gonna pick the crosshair application, run before the main application, so run this, then start the game, and then after I exit the game, I want my mouse cursor back, of course. All right, I want my cursor, type in cursor in the application name, path, click the green cursor icon here, all right, run after main application, make sure that's checked, okay, okay, now let's watch the effect. I'm gonna start Fruit Ninja, All right, and look at that. I have my cursor while playing Fruit Ninja. All right. Shoo. This plays well with the light gun too. All right. And then when I'm gonna exit the game now, I'm gonna press pause, quit, and LaunchBox knows that when you exit a game, run that script, run the uh, cursor exe, and bring us back to normal. See, look at that, my cursor's right back to normal. So another good example would be Big Buck Hunter Arcade. This was patched by Mystery Wizard, and this was his uh, first work for the arcade community, I think. Well, probably not, but this is the one that uh, we know him for. All right, so you see here, when I wanna play the game, I still have this uh, ugly cursor here. When I'm in game, it'll turn into a, a proper gun, but I, I don't like to see this cursor uh, navigating my menu. I'll show you. Let's see. All right, see now in game I have my curse, I have my regular shotgun, but in every menu, all right, let's say I escape, every menu I have a regular mouse cursor, which is kind of lame. So we do the same thing, edit metadata, additional apps, add application, cursor, sorry, oops, crosshair. Just add the uh, script again. Run before, okay, add another one, all right. That's to bring it back to normal. Run after, okay, okay, double click, and we're done. Look how cool, easy that is, and when I escape, it's back to normal, all right? You can adjust the size however you like, so let's say you wanna make it even bigger. Edit the script, I'm gonna change 50 to, let's say, 75, that's gonna be jumbo, all right? Save, 
right click compile that'll uh, update the the exe here watch double click now it's really big all right maybe you you're playing on a big screen and uh you know the scaling is not enough for you well now it's jumbo sized and you should not edit this one because this you want this one to return to normal every time you click on it all right that's all there is to it i'm gonna put this uh download in the description below Please uh, subscribe to my channel if you enjoy this content. There's a lot more goodies coming up. All right. If you feel generous, you can buy me a coffee on the donation link below. Thanks very much, guys. See you on the next one.